<laughs> that the yeah. former head of Israel space of the Israel Space Agency mm-hmm. claimed that a galactic federation of other aliens has not only made but has been in contact with the U.S. and Israel in secret, and says that the aliens won't reveal themselves until they feel like that humanity is ready for it. So, <clears throat> I feel like this that particular message has already been portrayed like years ago, maybe even decades ago. Like, if, if I'm been being here. honest, yeah, right. What's up? And so, like, I think the as far as the government goes, they're just waiting until. They feel like people can handle something like that. Like, if they tell people that shit right now, it's just going to be mass hysteria. See, and I don't understand that, though. I'd be like, okay, there's aliens now, so, like, what do we do about it? Well, I, I wouldn't say like, aliens what can I now. do about it? Not I, a goddamn I, thing. I would be like, I'm going to be honest with y'all. Like, if I was a government official, right, that had to present this, I'd oh, say, look, dude. Oh, they also said like, that Trump knows about it. Well, of course he does. He's the president. No, they, the president's they all know never about find that. out about aliens. No, that's... Bro, that is bullshit. That's off the books, bro. Uh, no, it is. It's actually in a, a whole book of a project that all presidents are aware of when they take the office. I don't think so, bro. This started. Bro, I don't think so. This I think started. The re- I think no, the reason why is no, because the president no, is only involved, no. bro, for a maximum of eight years, and then they're gone. Bro. I think like something of this magnitude requires consistency. Bro. So I think that I don't think the government. I don't think the presidents find out about shit. Oh, that no, that's a lie. I really nope. don't. Bro, I'm telling you. And if you, they do find out about some shit, I it, don't think they bro, tell them everything. Do you, you know? So the only reason we even really know about this is because a president told us about it. Who? Oh, <laughs> yikes, <laughs> bro. We're talking like a, a minute ago though. But I'm telling you, like all of our presidents that have be, been in office, they've seen these little crafts and heard about it, and they didn't really know how to respond to it, so they never really said nothing. One person came out and said like. I don't think there is a way to respond to it. Like it's they're not, just here and like that's it. I could tell you right now, every president definitely knows that aliens are real. Now whether they actually contact them and do all that, they do have that ability. Some probably just don't. But I'm not gonna sit here and say that any president now does like has no idea about it because that's nah, bro. It's not. The we case. can both say that. Like we're both convinced that they've been here. Like they're already here and they've been here for a while, right? Like I think we both agree on that. Uh, yeah, for yes. So I mean, the thing is, right? People think when it comes to aliens, right? You you have to have different perspectives about it, right? Like you would think if an alien came down here, people were like, oh, they would look green, they'd be bald, they'd have big eyes, and no, I mean, not all those things are probably well, they they're, they're, I mean, they're probably gray and have big eyes and they're bald. Like those are probably true, right? That would be true, yeah, yeah, but yeah. there are also aliens that look like human beings, supposedly. Maybe that'd be kind of cool. So I mean, have you ever seen you'd fuck them, right, dude? Where's my car? Yeah, those are aliens. Right. But did they look like it? No. It, there you go. Right. So they're saying like that movie uh-huh. was pretty much like a pinnacle of telling us they're aliens here. Right. They look like humans though. Okay. But I mean, people don't watch movies on the basis of thinking that they're trying to show us something or tell us something. Mm-hmm. But of course I do because I'm a huge conspiracy theorist. I, I dig it. So yeah. I watch all this stuff. I'm telling you, they're. You, would you they, fuck an alien? Without question, I'd fuck them if they look like one. I don't need them to even okay. look like a human. Yeah. What? Would be too much. There, are, there like what? What would the deal breaker be to fucking alien? There isn't a deal breaker. They're way smarter than us. They're more intelligent than us. Like, like, they know wh- what's up. They could you... probably make you nut like Dude. with their brains, and then have like all thirty babies like on like in a snap, and you'd be like, oh shit, oh hey buddy, <laughs> hey what's up little <laughs> this guy? Isn't what I signed up for. <laughs> hey, oh come here little buddy. Like uh, yeah, this bro, one's like, not great. No. Right. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think that one's mine. <laughs> <laughs> Mm, that one's a different color. Right, but right. I mean, dude, I mean, it, you would. Oh, like, I also want to oh, say, man. whenever I think of aliens, I don't. Uh, what is it? What a few, uh, American Dad. Um, I always think back to American Dad, uh, and they have aliens that could shape shift. Right. And I, I keep forgetting that's that saying. that's a superpower you can have. That's and what I'd I'm like saying. for it to be known that if there's any superpower I can have, we talked about this before. It'd be shape shifting. That's the one that I would like. Shape shifting to me, I. I uh, I like it and I appreciate it, but like I'd have to pick something like m- you could like look like anybody. mind wise though. I mean, mind is cool. But like they're saying, that's why I pick like telekinesis or I pick like maybe mind reading or something like well, that. Well, well, here's you know? the thing: you don't have to mind read. You can just look like that person's spouse and then ask them questions. I mean, that's true, but and at the same you time, if you don't know, like. How that shape shift is as, as that per- shape shift as that person's therapist. Yeah, but you also have, you also have to play like a certain like level of 
saying some shit to them that that other person would know because they'd be like oh why that's you, true they'd be like why are you, why acting, you acting weird, weird? Like, right why good. are you acting weird to anyways me? what's up like <laughs> right you know what i'm <laughs> like, saying like mm. like if you just shift like shift changes to somebody around you like yeah oh, i'm about to like get this shit tonight she's like you never touch me like leave me alone and move like what do you do like uh, uh well uh, tonight uh you're getting this shit tonight i don't tonight. <laughs> what's up you know so i that's why i don't really like sh- now shape shifting would be cool but uh, i mean i don't just i mean i see how it could benefit people but it could also put you in a very like crazy situation if yes. you shape shift it at the wrong time and you don't really know what the hell's going on but you have to act like you do because apparently the person looks just like you knew all this stuff already right. and then you don't know you're just kind of like Whoa. like uh, so what do you do like i'm gonna go to the restroom real quick and then you shape shift into a roach oh, hello and then like run out through the drain like i mean what do you do at that point like <laughs> yeah that that's that's a little insane but i mean i dig it though but uh, yeah, I mean, I'm ready for it. I think they're already here. I mean, I don't feel like the world's how ready you, for it. How but, do you I think mean, they would announce it? Like whenever they're whenever they're ready, they'll announce it with one. Whoa! I mean, so they, you, think, you think like press conference, like like side to side, like hey, they'll have to. <laughs> they'll they'll have to because. If, if yeah, well, because there'd be a lot of speculation, right? They'd be dude, like, "No, they're lying. Like they're full of right. shit." And be like, "Dude, or, look, he's right fucking here." Or dude. they'll be like, "They're dangerous and they're this and that." So you just bring oh, one so with they you would have and to they vouch. let them get on and be they like, "They have to vouch." So like, if they were here together, for peace. yeah, they'd be like, "Look, we're, like we're cool. We're not trying to look, like we're not trying to touch right. your buttholes or anything. Like everything's cool. We have stolen a few cows. We're sorry about it, but <laughs> right, <laughs> like what's up? They have to. Those do abduction it stories are real. We don't want to talk about it. Sorry, guys, are bad, but." Like we're cool, everything's cool. What's up? Exactly. I, I would. I didn't even exactly. think about that. That would actually make me feel good. I about mean, it. it would. It would make everybody feel better. Like they have to bring that out. Like, okay, with weird. One there. They're here. I with don't believe in Christianity anymore, so I don't know how to feel about that. But they you seem know? chill. So like maybe we're chill. Exactly. You know there. You know there would be extremists though. You know there'd be some crazy oh, I mean, fucking people. Th- there dude. is gonna be, but I, I feel like their best bet of when they need to when they tell us that. How about we just fucking kill them? They like they. <laughs> so and see that that would be the it problem. Sounds with it sounds bad, and that's a slippery slope. But no, dude, I felt that way about so much stuff. I'm like, I see. We don't need this person here. Like this person does like not contribute to society. They're a pain in everyone's ass. Let's just get rid of them. Right. I, I feel like you start getting like you said into a but that slippery is a slippery slope, slope though they're, they're, because they're like, then what if somebody tries to make an art like let's get rid of people you people are like, like well, well let's, no. let's kill the aliens well we don't even know what the hell they can do we know what we can do but we already know that they're smarter than us and like better than us in so many areas so right. how are we gonna try to kill them if we don't know how to extremists yeah. aren't always smart I'm not saying they're not always not smart, but right. they're not always I smart. I mean, I think that them announcing aliens to the world in general, it's going to cause chaos. No matter what they do, unless they wait like another 20 years. That'll be a fire and episode. Let, and let like my son, who's like now 11, be my age. And then he's like, oh, dad. Yeah, yeah I mean, we already knew aliens existed. Do it like... Kirsten already knows. He's like, yeah, aliens are real. Like, I, I've seen a bunch of stuff on them. And you talk about it all the time, Dad. And I'm like, well, I mean. <laughs> oh, yeah, his kids I don't listen w- to our show. Yeah, I, I don't want you to just listen to what I say. But he hears, like, real actual alien topics yep. outside of the show and, like, all type of conspiracies because yep. I'm always talking about this kind of stuff, right? So he be chiming in, listening when I'm talking to other people. And he's like, Dad, I never thought about that. Like, it's just the truth. So their best bet is either you bring them out now. And you have one with you, and just know lack of war is going to happen. Or you just wait another 10 or 20 years, and then y'all come out and say, like, aliens have been here. Like, y'all already know this. Like, right. What's up? Like, and, and I think it blows over easier if they wait a little longer. If they drop it now, they have to have one on stage, bro. Because if I they just that. say aliens are here, guys, people are going to freak the hell out. Because they don't, they're not showing you what they look like. So then people are going to be like, what do they look like? What if my neighbor is one? Or I actually know this one person who acts weird. Like, then it's going to mess it's gonna up get weird. everything, yeah, bro. 